Good morning everybody, <coughs> it's Grim once again from Unearthed, a, a windy and wet Saturday morning so no better time to show you wonderful people these new coin display cases uh, from exclusively from Unearthed. Uh, these are brand spanking new, Just this is a prototype actually, they're going to be on our website extremely soon but this is, um, we're, we're going to try our very very best to uh, revamp the coin display case world because you know there's pretty much not a great deal out there heavy plastic cumbersome uh, bulky boxes people buy tool boxes to put the collections in i've seen all sorts of weird and wonderful things that uh, people display their coins in and of course that's up to them but this is a completely new concept and i think a lot of detectorists and coin collectors will uh, we really like this product so I'm going to go through uh, a little bit now how it's made and what uh, it can achieve for you as a detectorist and a coin collector but let's let's have a look at it first a little bit closer so so as you can see it's made of high quality wood and it's quite thick I don't know if you guys can see that but it's a quite a thick uh, lump actually in that respect um, it's got a perspex clear perspex cover front to it and it's a very clever design in so much as this black strip isn't just for the looks and to split the coins it's actually keeps the it's a stop to keep the perspex lifted up slightly so you can slide the perspex frame over effortlessly effortlessly and it'll keep the coins do you know what? i can't get my words out today because i'm that bloody cold um It'll keep the coins pretty much tight in their little capsules. Now underneath here, it's like a rubber felt behind the coins. It's got a lip here, of course, where the perspex slides. Got a rather fancy curve in there. And of course, it's got the Unearth logo. And, and who can blame me for putting it on? So these coin cases <coughs> can display up to 28 coins of all various shapes and sizes. So... What I've tried to achieve at the start is, you know, start from the early ones, maybe the medieval period, and work down to the Tudor period on this particular display. But I give up halfway through because it was too time consuming. I was too desperate to get out and do this video for you. But as you can see, it can fit coins in as big as gold nobles, half nobles, sovereigns, gold, I believe it or not, that's a gold half crown, sixpences, shillings, groats. You know, I've just put it, I've just literally milled coins. I've literally just put together a handful of coins, 28 coins in total, to show you wonderful people how these can look. I mean, of course, you can put denarius in there, you can put Roman coins in there, you can put pennies in there, you can put anything you desire. Uh, it, however, a word of warning, uh, crowns, which are a lot bigger, uh, even bigger than the uh, gold noble, uh, actually, they won't fit in. So if you've got a collection of big silver crowns, um, we need to look at maybe making uh, an extra size up. But the really good thing about this is, is it keeps your collection clean, safe and tidy and other ones will stack on top of this effortlessly. So, for example, I'm moving my whole coin collection now uh, over to this, this display, these display units. And the reason is it's because it's, it doesn't take up a lot of room. At the moment, I've got them in chests, I've got them in wooden coin, uh, mahogany coin uh, chests with little drawers on. They, they take up a lot of room. These things don't take up a lot of room at all. You can put them anywhere safe. And of course, if you've got friends and family or other detectorists that would like to see your coin display, you can easily bring them out and show your friends them easily and they're on display without opening capsules up and everything else so a really smart design i think and um, we've <clears throat> we've actually sent a couple of these out to people just to get their feedback and it's gone down extremely well i really like the perspex it gives that protection the coins fit in there snug it is quite a tight fit remember because it's got to be a tight fit so you slide that off um carefully i would say just be nice and careful when you slide it off you put your coins in and then you gently slide it over into place so it fits flush with the edges and it keeps your collection looking really tidy 
Um, the other thing is, as, as well, as I said earlier, it will fit all host of different coins. And I've just put these together, medieval hammered coins and a few mill coins in there. But if people want to put the Roman collection in there, why not? Why not let, you know, do it? Um, so these will be on the Unearth website in probably around about a week's time, I should imagine. We haven't confirmed the prices yet, but they will be under 20 quid. Uh, and it's a, like I said, it's a really solid piece of wood. This is a really good way of keeping your coin collection safe visible if you need it to be visible and you can show people uh, who are interested of course what you find so there you go uh, it'd be really good to get some feedback uh, on this uh, particular film um, some of you people actually out there may actually want to develop it a stage further and give us some ideas but at the moment this is what we're playing with um, I, I have actually got another idea that will take it to a, to, to probably uh, a different level maybe not not maybe not the next level but uh, a different angle on things should we say that might be coming in the near future for coins uh, and we're also going to do an artifact one as well this year which will be really interesting uh, I've already seen a, a glimpse of that um, and of course we have to mention that these are UK made they're not made in China they're not, not made abroad they're all English British made so I'm really happy with that. Uh, it's nice to, you know, nice to work with some people in the UK that are manufacturing all sorts of weird and wonderful things. And this is one of many uh, items, accessories that's going to be coming out soon for the detecting world. So there you go. Gives you some idea of how you can display your coins. And again, for those that may have missed it, this strip here isn't just for display purposes. That's actually a rubber line. That's just raised slightly so you don't scrape the perspex. It just runs along there absolutely perfectly flush. So it's a really well thought out concept. So there are, or here are the new coin collection cases for collectors, detectorists alike. Give us some feedback, see what you think. Uh, like I said, keep your eye out on the Unearth website. These will be on sale probably from around about this time next week. Okay, I hope that's been of use. Um, please leave a comment or two and we'll all catch up relatively soon there's another episode of detecting talk coming this week so keep an eye out for that and of course it never ends some more product testing and some uh, actually believe it or not we're going to actually we're going to do some detecting next weekend and uh, we're going to be using the coil tech coil so uh, keep an eye out for that on the equinox and there she is okay Thanks for watching. Have a great weekend, everybody. Bye for now.